Jesus Christ, that is loud. I don't know if I'm live or not. Hold up a second. Let me just hold Twitch up here on the side again. It says I'm live. Just roll with it. Alright. Wait, what was that? Oh, it's 50% off. Yeah, okay. Um, so, these. This thing we should probably start off playing some freaking out. What's going God, I got like two of those gumballs earlier, so I'm gonna change. Uh, uh, I'm gonna change the points. Okay, let me see if this thing is streaming or not, I'm gonna be kind of annoyed. Up, oh, wrong one. Go to me. Yep, okay, there we go. Okay, now it's working. Alrighty, um, let me turn down my game volume a little bit. I've had left over a hundred for such a long time. Oh, sweet. Double max ammos and uselessness. Okay. Crap. Went way too far out. Okay, I was thinking of maybe doing startup on uh, the giant. And then after that, if whenever I get down or fight, like. Like, not immediately, but, like, let's say I get to, like, round past 10 or 15 or whatever that if I get down, then I'll probably just head on over to multiplayer, play a couple times, and play throughout the different zombies maps. Probably try to do, uh, and Draw Ha next or something. But, yeah. Uh, I'm liking those, and, uh, well, hold up. I forgot what this one does. That could actually be helpful sometimes. Okay. I'm not gonna waste a perkaholic on this map since there's only six perks and I could use it way better off in like something like Shadows of Evil or Revelations or something like that. I forgot, is the Wonder Fizz in Sh Revelations? I'm pretty sure it is. I don't remember. Uh. I really wish the loading screens didn't exist, though, because, like, I like your eyes and draws, and this one's loading screen, it just takes way too long to load sometimes, and it's just like, I'm spamming the A button. Funny, Doc. Turn around. Slowly. But out of all the zombies maps, this is probably the one I've played the most, considering all things, like... My highest round on this one, I think, is like 44 or 46 or something like that. 
then uh, next one would probably be Drys and Draha with like 35, I think. But after that, it's like round 12. Dimensional insertion point was off. Except on a uh, Zetsubo, because I don't continuity. like Zetsubo too much as a map. Uncertain. I thought it was kind of disappointing. I have no choice but to continue the mission alone. I know there's a lot of people that like that map. I just personally don't like it. It kind of reminds me of Shangri-La, though, of somewhat. Kind of like a Shangri-La and Shinonuma mixed sort of together. Yes. Oh. It's always like is a multi like round process for me. It's just like gathering points up just like by combining all the zombies together. You know what? I should probably go ahead and kill that dude. Cause Oh I'm Trying to get the most points here. Scared of shooting these guys because I don't want to die, so I'm just gonna save the heat. Infestation confirmed. Positive identification of 115 on site. As expected, my memory's slipping. Unable to determine current jump count to this location. Two at least. Okay, uh, Maybe more. Huh. I think probably. Ooh! I don't know if that's in the uh, factory, like the lower level or the upper level of the factory. But I'll probably just hang out in the. Catwalk and the Z, the, yeah, I think it's ZC, whatever it is, the room that they, uh, talk to them about. It's on the metal doors. See you later. Eh, I'll go ahead and get these three. I don't want to try to like accidentally grab a nuke out of one of these guys or like a uh, that's good but uh like I accidentally grab a nuke or like anything really I just want to make sure I'm getting what I'm getting because the nuke would suck in an early round like this the only time I actually really like a nuke is like if I'm in trouble obviously or if like it's like a late round like round 30 or something, and I just want to keep progressing faster than I am, because then it just, it just takes a long time, oh my god, oh god, that, wasn't too bad on that part though. It was at least the end of the round. What if I could go ahead and try to get that shopping free though? Oh my god! These taste a whole lot better than that baseball card gum. Need some more ammo. It, it is easy. Okay. Just trying to open the doors right now. Fuck! Oh, 
I've just wasted time. Fuck the one that I don't want. No, Jug! No! Dang it. I didn't want Mule Kick. Oh well. At least I can grab the Bowie knife. Slice him and dice him. So I could just stick here knifing zombies for a while. Uh. Initiate Link. I'll go ahead and initiate all these links early on. Maybe I can try to get double points right here. As long as no zombies just come up and kill me. I'll take it. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. This one over here. Remember whenever this game first came out back uh, came out in November of like I think this yeah this is 2015 Infinite Warfare came out last year but uh, whenever this game first came out I just played this map like non-stop and like it got to the point where every single day it's like I just was done playing this map and then Dry's Draha came out and I was so glad that ma map came out because I don't like playing Shadows that much because I just But, uh, I don't like the pack-a-punch process in Shadows, where you could literally just die, just instantly, just because. I thought, I, I think, like, but it's weird, though, because in Revelations, I like it how they did it in Revelations a lot more than in Shadows, even though it's pretty much the same exact thing, and even so with more guys and whatnot, but I just like it. But, uh... I think it's because in Shadows you have to do this whole process or whatever where you like turn into the beast, smash a couple crates and you're always trying to like get everything done it with one beast power or whatever. Where in like Revelations you can just like, what's it called? Uh, I'll take that. But uh, you can just pay like 500 points or whatever and you just instantly try the process and if you fail you can try again the next round or whatever. Hey, that's not too bad. I can have a round five. Or four. I like that shopping free. Ow. Too touchy feely, freak bag. I guess I'll go ahead and get it. Bring it on, freak bags. Okay. Uh, I'll try to. S I already got everything open. Jeez, man, this is weird. I usually have everything done by like round. Cool, BRM. But uh, I usually have everything done at like round twelve, but now I got it done at round four. I'm gonna open up on him now. This ain't too bad of a setup for right now. I want the dingo. Maybe a Tracon or whatnot. What's in here, speed? Yeah. I wonder if there's anybody that camps down in here. Because there's this whole tunnel down there or whatever. And they could just camp literally right here, but there's no way out. Because I remember one time I did a last stand in there, like at round 30. And I died just trying to get down there because there's that door and it was immediately right there. I 
I really love the Bowie knife in this. Like, it's such a good point getting a weapon. Like, for if you know how to, like, get it. Like, early enough. Like, because it doesn't last until, like, round 10 or 9, I think, is whenever it gets done. I think it's 9. It's like that's the last round. It's just a one hitter. Our asses are covered. But, uh. For a moment, anyway. It's all good, good jug. I don't know what to do. I'm getting points so early. I'm so glad, though, that I don't have to go in that area because I hate going in there to oh, get yeah. the uh, yeah, perk or whatever it's going to be. Why is the medicine always gonna taste like shit? It tastes like sushi according to Takeo. Uh, I traded that gun earlier. No box. Where's the zombie? I guess I'll just chill out in this courtyard. No dogs yet. Huh. I really wish they would have made like some sort of special easter egg for this map though, kind of like how they did with the other ones, even though this is basically like the Nuketown zombies on Black Ops 2. But like, that's like the biggest thing here is the mob of the dead plane. I don't know what else could be, like, of significance, because they didn't even have, like, the special, like, thing for getting the, uh, Annihilator or whatever until, like, a couple updates later, like, whenever Zetsubo came out, it was around the time I remember them doing the whole, like, plus a hundred, plus a thousand points, like, you get for, like, doing Shadows, Easter Egg, or Dreisendraha. Dude, I want to get this nuke. I gotta grab it. Eat that, the undead flesh monkeys. Amount of points or whatever. Oh. Oh. Line up maggot brains and lock stocked and cocked. Must be high noon, because I'm about to kill these meat maggots quick and dead. I'm gonna start hanging out the cow. Get used to that. Is there a laser sight for the BRM? Because I'm seeing it on the ICR, but I'm like. Oh! 
starts killing. That is not the last dude. I was like, is that the last guy right there? Can't really tell. And then I was like, oh, no, that's not the last dude. Not a gun, but still good. I'm so confused, I'm like, why haven't I gotten that guy yet? And then I was like, oh, that's why. Because he hasn't spawned. I hate getting the balcony dude right here because it's just like, I can't see, I'm blind, and I don't... Oh, hey. I never remember where he's at, but I guess... I don't know why it's called that, but it is. Like it, I really wish they would have done more with this map. Cause it would have been cool to have some sort of secret Easter egg, like actually seeing what Richtofen does with Richtofen. But hopefully in DLC five or whatever that they're doing, they're gonna have fucking. All new Easter eggs, whatever, from all the dead, moon, ascension, and whatnot. Mm hmm. Bullshit. I don't even know if DLC 5 is gonna be an actual thing. Like, I mean, I kinda want it to, cause that's another. That'd be a cool thing to have, like, old zombies maps, like, Mob of the Dead, Origins, Ascension, and stuff like that. Or whatever, but it's just like I wouldn't see Activision letting Black Op or Treyarch, Treyarch or whatever, just doing that. I mean, it's just like Activision wants to f try not to take focus away from the game that's they just released because they're just acknowledging that it's not doing well. I know Activision isn't that company to do that. They just wait until they release more stuff to, like, give recognition to the game. And if they're giving recognition to a game that came out earlier in life, or whatever, like in 2015 opposed to 2016, then they're going to be like, Well, I don't know, man. I mean, we know what this is what the community wants is more zombies maps, but how about you have some more zombies map for Infinite Warfare? It's like, we don't want those Infinite Warfare zombies. We want our old classic Treyarch zombies that are good and great, and they're... There's almost zero to none bad maps besides transit. I'm like, 
shadows, maybe, if you really don't care about it, but it's just like... Why? I really thought they were going to make remake Moon at some point, and then in freaking Derise Draw, you blow it up, and I was like, what the frick is going on? Like, what the hell, man? I thought we were going to go there. I thought we were going to see, like, a 1.0 character again or something. But no, we just fucking fired Dempsey off and did Neverland. I remember whenever we first got the game or whatever and we just played the giant crap like all the time because like like whenever we finally got done with the Shadows of Evil Easter Egg or whatever like the whole community we were just like we focused on the giant hardcore and I remember like the end like whenever we got this Easter Egg song or whatever and then by the end of it, it sounded like the moon theme was playing for the loading screen. Everybody was like, oh man, we're going to get a moon relay remake. Look, there's the wave gun blueprints in the background. And then Treyarch was like, cha, choke's on you, the moon's gone. It kind of makes me sad that they didn't take that opportunity. I thought, I feel like they had a change in direction in the middle of the process. Like... After Z probably Zetsubo, I think they probably changed what they were going to originally do. Because it just kind of like shifted. In my eyes. Like how they were going to make the maps and whatnot. Like I thought it was going to be some sort of spectacular f craziness of how it ended. But then just kind of seems shabby because like the whole ending is just again it's just a paradox and I thought there was going to be an actual ending like I thought zombies were going to be gone or whatever but no you just go back in time to restart everything over and mess everything up again Okay, sorry about that. Got a text. Sure. Yeah, so. Like, if you hear the background on this, it sounds like Moon. That I miss about the old classic zombies is that it kind of got a little complicated. Like, you had. About the classic zombies, you just had to get the mystery box or whatever and find the wonder weapon. That's why I like this map so much, is because the wonder weapon of the map is still in the box. Like, the Annihilator or whatever isn't the wonder weapon, it's just. I think it's just put in, just for whatever. But, uh, like in Shadows of Evil, oh, sweet, but in Shadows of Evil or whatever, the, uh, you had to create the freaking, what's it called, the Apothecan Servant, and Dries and Draha, you had to do part of the Easter Egg to get the upgraded bows, and then, uh, one thing that it ticked me off in Darius Draha was why they didn't freaking like have the uh, Hell's Retriever as like the obtainable weapon. That would have been cool. Like how you have the Annihilator and the swords or whatever. That would have been a cool thing to have the Hell's Retriever as that. But I kind of do like the Ragnaroks though. Because they are actually really good for, like, how I play for camping and whatnot. But I just thought the Hell's Retriever would have been cool, too. Or, like, have that as, like, a, uh, lethal replacer besides grenades. Or even, like, replace him with symbol monkeys if you really want it. But seriously, though, the Annihilator doesn't last as long as it should in this. Can't even upgrade it. Good. Oh, 
Yeah, that's real Try helpful. to get a ding up or something. Or Dracon. Wonder if this thing shoots one one five too. This gun is literally shit in this game. This gun is also now literally shit. Come on. Fuck you. Hope it spawns up here. I guess this is a better gun though than what I had before. HVK, everybody thinks it's. I like the uh, KN over there. But everybody, a lot of other people like the HVK. I think it's like a little split right there. It is a power so the HVK. The only reason I like the KN though is because I usually play this map and it's my go-to weapon for ammo or whatever on later rounds if I'm like... If I really badly... Oh shit. If I really badly like just can't keep up with the zombies taking all my ammo or whatever and I don't have like a gobble gum or anything or max ammo constantly being given. Then I'll just get the KN, pack a punch it two times, try to get turned or fireworks or something. And then uh just literally just camp right there. At the wall. Or if it's early enough or whatever, I'll just like continue this circle of like running from like I'm going up the stairs wait until all these guys at the stairs clear and then just run around and get up the stairs no oh, I'm gonna get the can right also we're just gonna pretend that's totally normal this I don't know why I did the Ooh. Fire fail. Oh damn. Now this is a deal I can't pass up. Now I just gotta wait for the zombie. Don't you freak back, see how this is always gonna go. This is a mistake, this is a mistake, this is a mistake. Does this still have my gunsmith thing on it? This just turns the fun knob well, that's right cool. up to eleven. One of these days, I'm gonna bust this shit wide open and find out how it really works. Sparkle, 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 sparkle. Ammo. Who's ready for a fresh round of bullets? Set up all the way through ground. Fire sale. Fire sale. Better not be selling cheap knockoffs. Screw 
that guy. Huzzah! Free refill. All right. Oh, yeah. <sighs> I guess just sit here until like nine o'clock at night. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Out of all of like the pack perks or whatever, I think Deadwire is probably my least favorite. Just back to that, it was a pain to get the special card or whatever for it so I can get Zombies Master. Or whatever it's called. ICR seriously box? Sam, seriously? You'd be right! And I'm back in the main course. It's not being stupid, it's being smart. Oh yeah, 
all chunks falling. So this might have been a mistake to do it right now. I gotta figure out how to get these upgrades without having to lay out so much dough. even all the way back there wow I almost felt like an idiot there the key word is almost I'm at the point now where I just want to progress faster through the rounds because it's just very boring right now. That's why I just got the XM and was like, ah, fuck it. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I hate how Blast Furnace does that, where it's just like, it catches the zombies on fire, but it takes like five seconds for the zombies to die, which I don't have enough time on that, even if I get them, like, at the bottom of the stairs, right? Fucking, fuck you. gone. I didn't even notice. <laughs> All right. Please be dogs. Thank you. the M8A1, but I don't remember if I, uh, have it unlocked. Okay, do I have this thing unlocked? m 8 a Fuck! Is that the dragon? It is! Better enjoy that noggin while you have it. This is the gun that I needed. The gun that I deserve. Pretty sure that's the last dog, so I'm not gonna bother. You know, I've hated Rick talking for okay. so long. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh yeah. Maybe I should kill him. Good things come to those who wait. Ah, oh, son Next of a fucking... Time, don't take so fucking long. Maybe this will buy me enough time to send out the Good. beacon. Get the fuck out of this damn place once and for all. Pretty relative beacon, Dempsey. 
Oh, please be ornamental. It's not. Candy's it's killed away. I'll take nice it. Change from basic rations. I forget what the quote is Nikolai says whenever you get the gumball. It's like, oh, so this is what capitalist pigs eat? Oh, no wonder the children are so fat. Yeah. I like the dragon because you can literally do this for several rounds and hitting like three zombies at once. Whenever you get scared, you just pop into your ammo bank. Although, this is even better. You can literally sit like this. <laughs> give out little perk holos or whatever whenever you got the teleporters activated. Don't know if they still do that or not though. Great, keep him out. For now. Oh man. It really bothers me whenever I miss some bullets with this thing because it's such a good gun. I just like the dingo better. This one has a better ammo capacity, but I feel like the dingo does like has more stopping power. Fuck you. Fuck you! Bye bye, Fox. Uh, should I just do snipers? That'd be fun. I've got a sniper challenge. Or at least try just doing snipers. This machine's been everywhere I have. France, Brazil, even the damn moon. Why is that? I gotta figure out how to get these upgrades without having to lay out so much dough. How did Jarhead? Oh, man. 
man. It's been a while since I'm probably gonna play like this. Just stream the game. That's gonna be the killer of this, is me trying to get max ammos. only gun I like there's like a few guns that I don't ever use in zombies and that's the Pharaoh the weevil and uh, I even use the Shiva like I use all the pistols so I'm just like what gun do I not really use it's just the Pharaoh and the Shiva not the Shiva the Pharaoh and the weevil uh, I use the ray gun sometimes whenever I'm training I forgot the double tap splits it into two bullets. It was like if you look at it, it's just like two. This dog! Max ammo! Max ammo! Max killing! Dude, so if anybody's listened to them, like, as of this being recorded or streamed or whatever, this was like, uh. This is like. Yesterday was Thursday or whatever, the 23rd, and those new gorilla, the four new gorilla songs came out, and man. Whew. I've been listening to gorillas all my life. And those, I really like those songs. If I had to rate them, probably my favorite being Andromeda, and then We've Got the Power, and probably Star Saturn's, Saturn's Burns or whatever. Saturn's Spirit House, and then, uh, last one being Ascension, because I am okay with that, but it's just not my genre. Fuck! I was too busy talking instead of thinking. Okay. I ain't turning into a here. damn meat maggot, am I? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit.
Oh shit, they're about to climb out that door. Oh, dude, the nuke with the clutch. God. I was being stupid there. But yeah, those gorilla songs are good. <laughs> I like them. None of them are my favorites, though. My favorite would still probably have to be a sound check. First album. I didn't think it did as great as Demon Days, but then like uh, the fall, they really received little to no attention from like outside, really, just because it was just followed or preceded by Plastic Beach. Was really well, the fall wasn't even like really okay. I'm about to get like talkative here, but to me, the best album ever from gorillas would probably be demon days because they put so much work into that album and there is not a song on demon days that isn't bad or necessarily not good like all the songs are either good and above plastic beach has a couple of songs that in my eyes aren't good and above like i don't care for stylo just because of that the dude, I can't think of his name. Like, not the 2D guy, but just the other dude. But, uh... The Fall wasn't very popular and stuff, and I think it's kind of good of an album, but it's, like, mostly electronic, which kind of goes a little against what Girls is somewhat, but then again, it was all made on an iPad, which it's a good... It's actually really good for being made on an iPad, and I think he did really well. Like, Damon Albarn and everybody did really well on that album. But, from ranking, the best albums are Demon Days, the Gorillaz self-titled album, Plastic Beach, The Fall, and the new Humans album. I don't know how it's going to be yet, but from its four songs, it's probably going to be it may be better than Plastic Beach. If it's got Snoop Dogg, then it's better than Plastic Beach, though. I like the... Saturn Bars, though, was... I like the music video for that song. The only thing I have a problem with it is that... I kind of feel like what they're doing with the Gorillas now, even though it was never, like, supposed to be... Like, it's supposed to be taken away from all the genres of music, but how Saturn Bars is, and plus the fact that there's Ascension for the two new release songs or whatever, I feel like Gorillaz is turning into, like, this hip-hop, mostly, band, which I thought, like, like how I feel Gorillaz should not have a specific genre named, but it's starting to feel like more hip-hop ish or whatever but then again most of the popular gorilla songs do have hip hop elements like feel good and clint eastwood really those both have rap in it and those are their two most popular songs on melancholy hill isn't though which i think that's like the third most popular on google play is melancholy hill i know their first is uh feel good though walking around my new room because I need a second to like think or whatever but yeah I'll look out this window real quick 
no one's home yet. Here by myself. When did I get level 31? I thought I hit level 30. Huh. Play some multiplayer after this or something. Uh, I'm starting to get a little tired of zombies. I have to be in like a really good mood to keep up like playing zombies though. Like for me to continuously play zombies on like hours on end and try to reach high rounds, I have to have like really good motivation. Like literally, I'll be like at around like. 30 or whatever, and I'll be like, if I'm not motivated enough, I'll just quit right there because I'm just not having fun any anymore, but if I'm that motivated to get a high round, I'll usually get to, like, round 40, and then I'll, like, start panicking and usually die. I've never gotten to, like, round 50. I don't know why I went down the stairs. Let's see how good this gun is. Not good at all, not good at all, not good at all. I've been trying to get uh, me and my brother, not my brother. He, I could consider him my brother though. He's kind of like a brother, but my uh, sister's boyfriend. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say his his name is Mason or whatever. Uh, me and him had this bed or whatever, like because I met, because whenever we started this bed, we were like both at like. 32,000 gamer score and I was like I made a joke to him because he'd been like constantly like me being above him in gamer score and then him being above me and we were both around the 32,000 range so then uh, I made a joke to him like hey I bet $10 that whoever gets the like I bet you $10 that I'll get the 40,000 gamer score first and he'd be like nah I take that bet I'll get there first and so then uh, we've been on and off again like that, and for a while there, he was like a couple hundred gamer score ahead of me because I got grounded. Shit. So I got nervous that he was just gonna completely overtake me, and I was just not gonna give any more effort for it. But then, like recently, he just stopped playing so much or whatever, and I got ungrounded. So now I'm just like, I've been achievement hunting and whatnot. Shout out to Rooster Teeth, but uh. Yeah. Right now, I think I'm like at a. I could probably check real quick, but I'd have to pause it, and I kind of don't want to do that because I've done that so many times. So let me just. This, and then. Okay. See, like, right now I'm at, I know you guys probably can't see this, I don't know how the, specifically the Twitch snap works or whatever, but I got 34,767. He has, I think, like, 34,699, which really annoys me that both of us have, like, different, that the in-digit or whatever, yeah, 34,699. But like the end digit isn't a five or a zero, which really annoys me, and I know exactly which game that it screwed it up for me, and it's Halo Reach. And it's so annoying because I don't. It's just like a pet. It's just like that's how it's been for so long. It's either been a five or a zero. It's like a speed limit sign. But now it's just like, oh, well, why? I've only ever seen in my life one speed limit sign that didn't end in a 5 or a 0, and that was at a parking lot in uh, Destin, Florida. We, I was just like, in, it was like in this, uh, like a, kind of like a pier park kind of thing, like a boardwalk with a bunch of shops on the side. In the parking lot, it was 7.5 miles per hour going through. But what really just bothered me is why they couldn't have put like 7.5, or even like, uh, just like 5. Or something, because it was even a cr it was a tight space parking lot. But yeah, one of the, the achievement that I need to get for Halo Reach or whatever 
it, uh, the one that I got was like 42 gamer score, and the one that I need to get is 13 gamer score. So I can even it out again. Because the only other game that I think that I can think of that actually did that, where it just split up the gamer score in like a weird number, was Civilization. I remember they had like 3 gamer score, 9 gamer score achievements. Off here for a second. <coughs> oh god. I forgot my mic does this where it will. where I can actually take the speaker out of the headset to move it up tighter and less tight. And I forgot it did that. So I just like, I grabbed it and then I tried to pull it away or it stick off and then it just immediately just broke off. I gotta cough again, damn it. <coughs> I'll just go ahead and get some water real quick. Be right back, guys. Alright, got the water. Whew. I was going to die there on the way back down. Alright. Oh, yeah. Let's get back into this. Round 30. I can do this. <sighs> I really regret doing the sniper thing, though. But I, I feel like it's a better challenge, and I'll probably enjoy it a lot better. I'm, I'm going to guess, though, that I'm going to die in the next five rounds. Just because that's the average for me is like dying around 35. Alright, where's that friggin' bug at? It's like spinning it. If I had mule cook, I could get three seconds. get started back to like posting stream stuff but like the only time I could do it was either during the summer or during like a weekend at home somewhere where I can have a stable Wi-Fi connection because where I live it's just so out in the middle of nowhere with our satellite it's actually DS like it's not DSL it's satellite internet so it's even worse than like DSL It's like, it's worse than Walmart and McDonald's connection Wi-Fi, and it's so bad, I can't, like, I think the download speed on it is like 20 kilobytes or something. Not megabytes, kilobytes. Shit, shit, shit. Fuck. I'm gonna make them wish their mamas were here. Whoa, what the fuck? Hey, um. I'm gonna try to wait it out. Shit. Wait, there's the. Uh, that's what I thought it was. I thought it was like. You can either drink a bunch of perks or use the pack a bunch of lot of perks. I couldn't remember what it was. Let's see him come at me now. I'm gonna try to get a different gun. Back in 
here? Or is it way up there? I think it's way up. They shouldn't be back in the same spot. I'll try to get that dingo. Good for me, bad for you, freak sex. Look at what we have here. Let's rip some. Damn it, give open. me the fucking dingo. Shit. Little gun. Fuck. Souls. Still need to reserve like 750,000. Fuck. I need to reserve like 7,500 points for the uh. I'm really getting sick of this. Fucking pack a punch and we pack a punch. I'll try to get. That's too good, right there. Ooh, please give me a good gun. I'm tempted. Anyone else? The tempt was too how this real. thing almost talks to you when you kill a lot of freak bags. Yeah. Okay. It off with the Wonder Wasp DG Jay Z or whatever it is. I think it's the Wonder Wasp DG3 Jay Z. Now that's what I call a gun. Yeah, DG3. Like there's any other name for it. That's actually kind of. Did he just say it's the Wonder Wasp? If you know, if ever like if there's a name, other name for it? Cause that'd be fun. That's actually kind of funny because everybody called it the Wonder Wasp. I got the Wonder Waffle! It's like, oh, good for you! Shit, I got too cocky. Honestly, wouldn't care if I died though right now. Don't kill Tank Dempsey that easy. Uh, final stand. Take my wonder off. Die. Done. 
done playing this game. Now I want to go to multiplayer and play against real people. Yes, kill me. Haha! I live. Damn. say probably like an hour and a half. But yeah, I'm gonna switch it on over to multiplayer here in a second. Oh shit, okay. Uh. Oh dude, I can finally level up the Gorgon! I wanted to do that. Do some spit. Oh shit. Um. Is it not telling me how long it is? Fucking shit. Except for cash A back. Um can I do anything in here? Oh medication. What is that? I guess I'll do it. What is that? It's an ultra rainbow. Oh damn it! Yourself. Keep all your perks. Holy fucking shit. That would be good, except it, you have to get a kill in last stand, which is super hard to do with just freaking. I guess it wouldn't be too bad with just death and taxes. My friend. She's a uh, home. Like I was just texting her a second ago, like, "Yo, text me whenever you get home or whatever." She's like, "I'm home now," and I was like, "Oh shit." I want to play some fucking Xbox, but I kind of keep doing shit right now on here. So she's going to have to fucking deal with it unless she just, I hope she doesn't make fun of me. Suck. Yeah, I'm the piece of shit. <laughs> I'm this kind of piece of shit. Uh, let's do some, uh, Zero percent in any of these down. Gun game just isn't good on Black Ops 3. It was so good on Black Ops 1 and 2. And they don't have sticks and stones anymore. God, that was a good one. I'm 
not gonna play free for all because people freaking try to no scope and that all the time. Let's just play some kill confirmed. At least try to. You guys are gonna watch me suck. Oh, Nuck 3 Town. But you guys are gonna watch me suck ass at Black Ops because I haven't played online in a long time. We're up against three Scythe, Dyke, Scythe, and James Bond. Um, let's see. Kill confirmed. Now, it is the Commander One. Well, I saved somebody from an HCXD. Hey, you're welcome. Fuck! As I said, I am not good. That's a kill. Fuck. Come at me, bros. Ooh! I experienced that lag. Oh, dude, we got. We don't have phase. We got Ezaf. Fuck, man. Hold up. Friendly UAV inbound. Shit. Okay, that was. Oh god, I'm out of ammo! <laughs> Shit! Tacom, need UAV eyes on. Mistakes were made. They were indeed. It was a self-sacrifice that was needed to make Hostile hill for overhead. Ah, bitch. Fuck. HCXD moving out. Hostile UAV spotted. Hostile lightning strike targeting active. Hostile lightning strike. Oh, bitch. Fuck. Fuck. I forget what it's two. Is it two a hundred with kill confirm? Oh, we got phase and he's F. Oh shit. Fuck. 
Reaper, KIA. Hostile Hellstorm inbound. That's a kill. I might have gotten the final kill if they accepted it on our end. Which would be cool. Hey, I did. Everybody was wailing on him though. <laughs> Shit. Hey, there I am. Which one's the pop and lock one? This one, I think. Even death can upgrade. Care for a taste. So cool. See, he's F, he's ass, correct, he's F. I can tell who's all in a party. Map 310 offline. Is that the only multiplayer map that has a special ending like that? I'm pretty sure it is. That was a fun game, though. I think I'm gonna have to call it quits there, though. I'm kind of done. I think that was a good session, though. I'd like to play more. It's just... I kind of don't want to. <laughs> I think I should make the mistake of trying to do, uh... What's it called? Both multiplayer and zombies. I should have just done like a zombies one of just that and then like try to do the multiplayer one later on this weekend. But yeah. I'm gonna call it quits there first. So, uh, thanks for all the people who tuned in for the stream or whatever. And, uh, thanks for the people who are watching this later on YouTube whenever I post it up there. So, uh, later.